Hey race team, this is Jason at Go Power Sports and I'm going to show you what a lap of the GPS 180 this year will look like. You win. Perfect. When the starting gun goes off, you'll start the bike and pull out of Petey's pit lane, which is our starting and finishing line. Now we're headed down Trailmaster Trailhead, but heads up, you'll end up taking a tight U-turn at the end of the runway. Next, we're going into tilts and turnstile. These switchbacks are a new addition to the track this year and will also double as the junior's track. The junior's race is an hour long race that starts at 10 a.m. before the main event. Participants 15 and under will battle it out to see who can finish the most amount of laps in 60 minutes. Single riders and teams are allowed. race categories for the main GPS 180 event. Softtail, which means your mini bike has rear suspension, hardtail, which has no rear suspension, and juggernaut. The juggernaut is for our solo riders riding in either softtail or hardtail. They may have a pit crew. Now, let's go over a few rules. Outlaw engines are allowed, must be a four-stroke engine, and must be pull started to begin the race. No gears. Clutch and torque converters are allowed. 10-inch wheel max. Must have working handlebar kill switch. Must have working brakes. Every racer must wear a helmet, ankle covering shoes or boots, long sleeves, and long pants. Gloves and goggles are highly recommended. Every participant must sign a race waiver. This is more than just a race. It's a full weekend experience. Come Friday for some practice laps and a scavenger hunt. Camp out under the stars and soak in the incredible community vibes. So whether you are a seasoned pro or a first time racer, the GPS 180 is something for everyone. Head over to gps180race.com to register now. It's only $25 per rider, but the memories, those are priceless. For the juniors race, they will go straight into Petey's pit lane from here and continue doing laps. For the GPS 180 main event, all the racers will hang a left. We'll take a sharp left into Sherwood Forest Part 1. Tackle Mega Moto Mountain. At the top of the mountain, we'll head into Sherwood Forest Part 2. Here are a few of my tips for racing in the GPS 180. I would take some air out of my tires for a smoother ride, 
climb your tires in case you get any punctures. Taller tires will help with ground clearance, especially on the back end of the course. Since there aren't that many straightaways to open up the throttle, I would go for a torquier gear ratio. 6 to 1 or higher would be optimal. A stage 1 will help you get over some of the hills, but the power of the stage 2 will help you conquer the steep portions of the track. Packing items on your minibike is a great insurance plan. Here are a few things I would have on my minibike during the race. A Leatherman or multi-purpose tool, a spare belt, a spare chain that's already fitted for the minibike, a few master links, an extra air filter, zip ties, a crescent wrench, and a handful of popular sockets such as an 8mm, 10mm, 13mm, and 14mm along with the ratchet. burst out of the forest and head down, around, and up the elevation and turns of the U. Stop descending the ever popular Pucker Up Buttercup. Now's the time to open up the throttle from Juggernaut Junction. have an accident, be sure to pull off the racing line to avoid further injury. We will have spotters that will come to your aid and will call in a rescue vehicle if needed. We'll have an ambulance and paramedics on site just in case. take the high road to Bolt Boulevard.
Heads up, race team. There is a steep drop-off at the end of Bolt Boulevard. Be sure to slow down. Back at PD's pit lane, we will slow down to switch riders, mark your time on your timesheet, perform repairs, grab water, and then get ready to do it all again. That's our course this year. Many thanks to the folks who helped us revamp and reimagine the ranch track. And we're excited for you all to come out for the fourth annual GPS 180 on Saturday, November 9th, 2024. For more information, head to gps180race.com and make sure you sign up at gopowersports.com. Stay safe, stay fast, and as always, ride on. How'd we do, Bernie? I tracked you the entire way. No way. Hell yeah. <laughs> Tight. There's some parts I was like super high, but yeah. Tracked yeah, but what about the drone? No, no, no. Dude, that was awesome. All right, Bernie and I just completed one lap of the GPS 180. Be sure to be here November 9th, bright and early. Even come the day before for a scavenger hunt. Uh, but we'll see you guys then. Peace!